you know, I see this a lot with people I speak to. I see the, uh, the, the what, what Elizabeth Kubler-Ross referred to as the five stages of grief, even though she recognized that people went back and forth and they were kind of fluid, um, that, that there's uh, um, denial and anger. I get a lot of that. And bargaining. And, and I think that this zero-point energy and electric cars sort of fall into that category of bargaining. We, we want to keep things going the way they are. In fact, that's how we define sustainability, is we get to sustain whatever we're doing. Right? <laughs> and never mind the consequences for other species and future generations of humans. Sustainability means I get to do what the hell I want, which is what I've always done. People say... Well, if people get if people catch on to your message and really adopt it, don't you think they're going to become hedonists? Well, they Not might. Like, like <laughs> Americans become hedonists. <laughs> what I tell the difference? <laughs> but, but, but we but have the Paul, world's reserve currency. We do what we want. But that Paul Ehrlich, maybe he said early in that talk, he said, "You want to become a member of the Titanic Club?" Right. Right. And he said, "All you have to do is remember this motto." If you, if you buy a ticket for the Titanic, don't go steerage. Exactly. <laughs>